Unlike alkenes, benzene does not react with bromine unless a catalyst is used. Consequently, when FeBr3 is added to a mixture of benzene and molecular bromine, electrophilic aromatic substitution occurs to produce bromobenzene. The mechanism involves the bromine complexing with the Lewis acid to produce a more electrophilic halogen species that is then attacked by the nucleophilic benzene ring in the rate determining step. This produces a resonance stabilized carbocation, which is subsequently deprotonated to give the halobenzene product as well as the reformed Lewis acid catalyst. Because benzene is only weakly nucleophilic, a catalyst is used to activate the halogen electrophile. Complexation of the catalyst with the halogen makes one end of the halogen more electron poor and therefore more reactive. The enhanced electrophilicity of the halogen forces the benzene to attack as a nucleophile in the rate determining step to break the weak halogen halogen bond and afford a resonance stabilized carbocation. Even though the intermediate carbocation is not aromatic, it is stabilized by significant delocalization across most of the cycle. In order to regain aromaticity, the second step of the process involves the halide complex deprotonating the intermediate sigma complex. This provides the halobenzene product, a molecule of HX byproduct, and the Lewis acid catalyst, which is then free to recycle back into the process. Although benzene does not react at an appreciable rate with halogens, it may be induced to react if a Lewis acid is added to the reaction mixture. This makes the electrophile more reactive, which forces the benzene to participate. 